Remember that massive jackpot somebody won in our state a couple of weeks ago or months ago now? Mm -hmm. Well, nobody has claimed the prize. And in case you forgot, it was a $1.5 billion Mega Millions jackpot ticket. So where is that winner? And what happens to the money if that winner never comes forward? Our Jacob Reynolds joins us now in the studio with the details on that. Jacob, I think it's in a landfill. I really do. <laughs> oh, that'd be well, heartbreaking. <laughs> well, ladies, that's the question. The jackpot would pay out $877 million in the lump sum cash option if claimed. But to do that, lottery officials need a winner. The winning ticket was sold at that Casey Mart number no. seven in Simpsonville. The store has a vested interest in finding the winner as well, because without the winning ticket, that store loses its $50,000 bonus and the state will lose out on $60 million in tax tax revenue, which some politicians have already planned on spending. But lottery officials like Holly Armstrong are staying positive that their winner is simply waiting. Well, we're still very excited here at the South Carolina Education Lottery. Because this is such an unprecedented sum of money, we recognize that it might take the winner a little bit longer than normal, but there's really not a normal when you're talking about a $1.5 billion jackpot. There's nothing to compare that to. Now the winner has 180 days from the drawing to bring his or her ticket to the Rewards Claim Center on Assembly Street right here in Columbia. That means mid-April of next year. Holly told us April 19th, which is a Friday, but technically the 180-day deadline is Sunday, April 21st. Ladies? Aww.